Chapter 2 Family Time to Think Write down the names of the family members who play with you, cooks food for you, tells stories to you. Let us read about Rima's baby sister. Today, Rima's mother and her baby sister came home from the hospital. Her father went to the hospital to bring her mother home. Rima's mother was carrying a little baby wrapped in warm clothes. The whole family was waiting at home to see them. Rima's grandparents were also there. Rima is very excited. Her baby sister is really tiny. She can't wait for her to grow up. Rima's family has grown from five members to six. Look at Rima's family in the above picture and answer the questions. A. Where is Rima? B. What does Rima's mother have in her arms? C. Who is the youngest member of Rima's family? All kinds of families. A family can have a few or many members. So, families may be small or large. A family in which only parents and children live together is called a nuclear family. A family in which many members live together is called a joint family. Mike lives with his mother in Pune. His mother is a teacher. Mike has many friends. Mike's father passed away when Mike was a little boy. Sometimes children may live with a single parent. Today is a special day in Sishukendra. 30 years ago, on this day, Sishukendra was founded. It is a home for children who have lost their parents. They have prepared a program for the guests. Many people who have lived here as children will also come here today. Some children may have lost their parents when they were very young. Many of them live together in orphanages or large homes like Shishu Kendra. At times, people adopt the children and give them love and care. When children are adopted, they become a part of a loving family. Nitty gritty, sister or a brother is known as a sibling. Helping one another. Members of a family help one another in many ways. Priya and Praveen are doing their homework. Repeat. Priya and Praveen are doing their homework. Mother is helping them with their homework. Every day, the children complete their homework before going out to play. They both help mother in setting the table. On Sundays, Priya and Praveen work in the garden with their father. They are learning to take care of plants. Saf's grandparents take care of him when his parents are at work. His grandmother tells him interesting stories every day. Saf also helps his grandparents in many ways. He fetches and carries things for them. He goes for a walk with them every evening. Learning at home Children learn many things from the elders in the family. Ravi's father is an artist. He loves to paint. The studio is full of paintings and cans of paint. Today, Ravi is learning to paint. His father has given him a small canvas, paints and a few brushes. The Extended Family We, our siblings and our cousins are a part of a generation. Our parents, their siblings and cousins are another generation. People who are related to our mother are our maternal relatives. People who are related to our father are our paternal relatives. A family tree. Rima wanted to know all about extended family. Her father told her about her family with the help of this family tree. Nitty gritty, your parents, brothers and sisters are your immediate family. Your grandparents, aunts, uncles and cousins are your extended family. Generation 1 Manjeet Singh and Tanvir Kaur, Reema's paternal grandparents. Avtar Singh and Swarn Kaur, Reema's maternal grandparents. Generation 2 Kuldeep Singh and Sumitra Singh, Reema's paternal uncle and aunt. Arjun Singh and Tavleen Kaur, Reema's parents. Milka Singh and Daisy Joseph, Reema's maternal uncle and aunt. 
जनरेशन थ्री वंश नाइन ईयर्स ओल्ड मोहन फाइव ईयर्स ओल्ड रीमा सिक्स ईयर्स ओल्ड वृंदा फाइव ईयर्स ओल्ड केविन टू ईयर्स ओल्ड Answer the questions given below using Rima's family tree. Name the siblings in the third generation. To which generation do Brinda, Rima and Kevin belong? Who are Rima's maternal grandparents? How many children do her grandparents have? Who are Rima's parents?